All right, we're going to tie a real simple flush fly in the vise. I've got a Mustad S80-3906. It's a size 6 hook. It's a 3X hard. And so the big thing with some of the trout up here in Alaska is you want to have a nice heavy-duty hook. I'm going to go ahead and get a thread base going here. And one of the bigger mistakes people make when they tie flesh flies for Alaska is they tie really bright pinks and you know kind of bright fleshy colors and they do work um, just kind of depends on the system and the time of year but for the most part you know typical salmon flesh in the water is going to look something like more like this mostly like this cream and then you've got your tans and um, another kind of variation of cream but uh, you really want to tie in these kind of off-white colors and gingers and things like that. So I'm going to grab a cream rabbit strip here and for the tail, this is all one material, so for the tail I'm just going to measure out about the length of this rabbit uh, flesh here. It's going to be about the same length as the shank. I'm going to measure that out and pull back the fibers, the hairs. We'll tie that directly on the top of the back here as our tail. And I, for whatever reason use red, the red for my flesh flies, just something I like to do. And we'll go ahead and kind of reinforce that. We'll spiral our thread forward to about where we'll start our head. And then we're just going to wrap this rabbit fur forward. Touching turns. I really want to fold this rabbit fur back. This is a good dead drift fly for Alaska. And once we get to about where that head is, start pulling some of that hair back and Go ahead and tie right over the top of that, locking that in, trying not to trap too many hairs. And we'll fold this back and I like to tie right up against that leather. That'll really squeeze it between the, the leather wraps and nip it off and you'll have a little bit of leather left at the front. And I like to just kind of tie that right down. And we'll go ahead and form our head. And like I said, this is good in different uh, colors like this cream, your tans, your gingers. You can also make like a ginger tail or and a cream body or a cream tail and a ginger body. But uh, really want to stick more to that dead flesh kind of coloration. We'll go ahead and do a little whip finish here. And you can finish that off with your favorite head cement of choice. We'll give Alright, we'll give this a quick brush and show you what it looks like. And there's a quick, easy flesh fly for Alaska. Thanks for watching.